Okay guys, someone had asked about the uh, monogram fonts and how to do those. Okay, this is scale because if you use Canvas, uh, the, <laughs> the font choices aren't very good, um, especially if it comes to doing monograms. Um, every font that I have loaded in my computer, which there is a gazillion because uh, I like to collect things, um, they will come up in here. This is the library. So every font on my computer is available for me to use in any design that I so choose. Okay? We're going to use the monogram font. I'm going to come over here and we'll use my initials. Come up here. Okay. And now we'll come to object, ungroup, grab the J, bring it down a bit, bring it over here. Yeah, that looks good. Same thing with the B. You want to try to keep them the same size. And those little blue bars that snap up kind of help. Okay. stretched out there. Alright, that looks good. So I'm going to come in here, I'm going to highlight it. Um, go up to File, Export, FCM. If you have your USB stick, you can actually, of course you want to go in and name it, but um, I already have it done. Okay, so there. You can actually come in and it would be right here right here would be your USB stick name okay so you can double click on that and it'll open that up and then you click save and that'll save it directly to your USB stick so you don't have to go monkeying around looking for folders where you forget where you put it I know because I do it all the time I'm famous for that um, or if you want to just save it as a picture, let's say you do up a file for somebody and you're not sure if they're going to like it, instead of saving it in a FCM already, come down here, click JPEG, and that'll save it in a picture, okay, in picture format. Um, and then you can re-import that later uh, and change it if they want. So if you're going to put this on HTV, the heat transfer vinyl, you're going to want to flip this. So we're going to go Object transform flip horizontal which is a mirror and that's how you do that with the HTV you don't want to um, cut through that uh, kind of shiny carrier plastic whatever you want to call it that's on it um, that helps one helps you to be able to kind of move the design around and not have it all fall apart and it also helps keep that vinyl um, from melting burning singeing any of that stuff so you don't want to cut through that you want to try to keep that all as a sheet um, if you can uh, I can't really think of anything else if you guys have questions please let me know thanks guys